Welcome to The Shooting Show. This week we bring you a blooper fest, showing you all the outtakes from 2017 that you weren't meant to see. Plus we bring you all the latest news from the shooting world. Another glorious day dawns for me and the Shooting Show team. We'll be out hunting in some of the world's most breathtaking landscapes. What could be better? And of course, it's all ruined by 6am when the cameraman's already started making me look a prat. Um, the hairstyle is monocleater. What are we going for? Rough and ready. I like the glove. In fact, everyone's at it. Morning. It's because you've been shouting off this morning. <laughs> Yes, that's what you get on the shooting show. Long hours, bad weather, no appreciation, and a team of presenters and cameramen that can't keep a straight face for more than five seconds at a time. You might think working with animals is hard, but it's nothing compared to this lot. I did it. <laughs> you did it, I'm sorry, well done. <laughs> I can't believe I'm praying. No problem, excellent. Just pause, just give it a chance for you to cut it. Do an odd and then do no problem. No problem. Right, we'll do it again. So pause. Can you not do that in the back? <laughs> so, Jeff, thank you very much. My first month check. No problem, mate. I'm glad it's, uh, it was a success. I'm going to start again. Is that attached? Just yank it. So, yes, sir. That must be crap. So, Jeff, thank you very much. My first month check. No problem, mate. I'm glad it was at six. Oh, for <laughs> sake, man. <laughs> just, Here we go. just can't get the staff anymore. <laughs> I've never been in front of a camera before. <laughs> yeah. Some sh slow Are you not still recording now, are you? No. No, you're just talking bollocks, Jimmy. Um. <laughs> what is it that uh, people are most interested in from the air on screen? Which air? <laughs> Definitely the guys. Thanks so much. Me, of course. <laughs> so last time I was here, there was two walking up this valley, and they're here again. Yes. 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 <laughs> I just can't hit anything today. Shot a real nice long hand. Which will be included in the film, I hope, George. 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 George, George that's George. your name. We've been waiting out in the high seat for hours, with no action whatsoever. But that's about to change. I've always wanted to shoot under a full moon. <laughs> you <toss. laughs> Of course, when it comes to testing the latest and greatest shooting gear, everyone's queuing up. If only we didn't keep making such a hash of it. Um, so you only need one bipod, no matter how many rifles you've got. You just buy a series of adapters. So basically, oh, that's not good. You have to start again. That's that was loose. On top of everything you have a telescopic shroud which you can lock 
<laughs> yeah, normally you can lock it. <laughs> one for the blue was real. <laughs> nice, it looks a bit of a strange shape of a blade, but uh, no, it's really nice to use. Nice yeah. in the hand and, uh, and very sharp. Yeah, ergr ergonomically, they're fantastic. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. Is that the same as ergonomically? Yeah, it okay. is, but it's the Yorkshire variant. Just checking. Here's the other car brother demonstrating how to use wind checking powder. Step one, whatever you do, don't fit it into the wind. And here's Stuart totally failing to cycle around properly in his Browning rifle. Then not realising his error and trying to shoot the fox without a round in the chamber. Do you think you missed Stuart? He's still no idea what's going on. Ailey Pigeon HIV. Pigeon shooting supremo Jeff is putting those Ely HIV loads to good use. Managing to uh, hit nothing. In the coaching manual, the term I'm looking for is f***ing hell. F***ing bollocks is another one. The RSPB rang earlier, they're thinking of sponsoring you. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what, I'd need a lot of money, mate, how I'm shooting at the moment. After many, many more attempts, Jeff finally remembers how to shoot. You get that one? Yes, we got it, Jeff. But where's your hat? Come on, we haven't got all day. Last year we made fun of cameraman Dean Fletcher for missing a shot by filming the wrong deer. And this year he's not learnt from any of his mistakes. The shot deer to the right, no Dean, that's the left. Luckily Dean can redeem himself with some educational input during the Gralloch. Not going to get a chance to use those again this year Good unfortunately. Good pair of nuts, thank you Dean, I'm sure everybody knew what they were. But the hardest part of the entire show has got to be working with you. Yes, you, the great British shooting public. Uh, ...donation rifle last year, $250,000 for our Corbett commemorative rifle. And the uh, Corbett commemorative rifle. The product of the game, so it's certainly placed, uh, missed out on its place here in the... <laughs> <laughs> Happy New Year from the Shooting Show team. And to play us out, here's my X Factor audition. <laughs> well, that's the Shooting Show team having a bit of fun from the cutting room floor there. And now, it's the Shooting Show News. This is the Shooting Show News. 2017 was another record-breaking year for interest in firearms, says Basque. The Basque Firearms team dealt with more than 10,000 queries by phone, email and post, breaking the previous record with several weeks to go. The most pressing issue this year was the involvement of the medical profession in firearms and shotgun licensing, with some GPs refusing to provide medical reports or demanding payment to do so. And as ever, licensing delays were a popular topic. Bass said it was continuing to press for efficiency improvements in the licensing process. And it was another big year for the Basque BDS and Sporting Rifle Head Measuring Service. The service continued its trend of growing every year since its inception. All the latest heads, along with some of the best from previous years, are collected in the second edition of the Records of British Game, out now. This book is not just about keeping score of who shot the best head, it's also a valuable snapshot of the state of the UK's national deer herd and provides evidence that our deer are in better health than ever. Get your copy now from myfavouritemagazines.co.uk New licence forms for certificates and variations are now in effect. The new forms take a dramatic step towards simplicity and ease of interpretation, according to the shooting organisations who helped draft them. The Countryside Alliance said that using the new form would speed up the licensing process. 
If you've been filling in an old form, don't worry, it'll still be accepted for eight weeks. Download the New Look form from the Countryside Alliance website. And finally, don't forget to cast your vote for the nation's favourite shooting ground. The annual poll run by Clay Shooting Magazine closes on the 12th of this month. You can vote for the overall winner as well as regional and discipline awards and which ground has the best breakfast. One voter will be drawn out of the hat to win a pillar eyewear set worth £1,500. Pick up a copy of Clay Shooting for a voting form or head online to clayshooting.com nfsg. That was the Shooting Show News. Well, that's it for this week. Thanks for watching. Please like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. And if you're not a member of Basque, it's time to join now. Basque, looking after your sport, looking after you. This has been The Shooting Show and a Happy New Year to you all. <laughs>